Each year, many people join a network marketing company with high expectations of massive income while doing very little work because they think that their upline will build their downlines for them. Well, about a week into the program, reality kicks in and they quickly realize that they actually have to work in order to see any money come in. I know, I know, work. Ugh. Well, those who rake in tens of thousands or even hundreds of thousands each month don't rely on their upline to build their downlines. They recognize that in order to bank it, it's up to them to make it. So how do they make it? Well, the secret is very simple. They don't recruit. They sponsor. Many network marketing companies incentivize affiliates to recruit other sales affiliates with fast start bonuses, which is great and all, but that's what we call one-time money and it's not residual one bit. Obviously, it will improve your profitability and recruitment numbers if your new affiliates stick around for a while, but it's very common to have high turnover because these affiliates aren't properly trained or know how to replicate their efforts and sponsor rather than recruit. By setting aside time and resources to properly sponsor your affiliates on how to effectively talk to people, fully understand all aspects of the business, and value consistency, you will see a much different result than those who do nothing and expect everything. Sponsoring is all about personally helping each person you personally brought on to grow their business. It's placing their success above yours because if they succeed, you will too. There is a reason why so many self-help gurus preach this principle because it's 100% right. All right, so let's get specific on how to effectively sponsor someone and not just recruit somebody. The first thing that you need to do is be honest. Nothing is more damaging to your business than lying to those you're trying to sponsor. That's right, I said it, lying. If you tell them that they're going to make X amount of dollars a month guaranteed, that's a lie. You need to be honest with them and show them what it actually takes to make X amount of dollars per month. Don't give them the illusion that they will make big money no matter what because it's not true. Be honest with them about what their expectations should be and what it takes in order to see real money each and every month. This is an industry that has produ produced more millionaires than any other industry, but you need to understand that there is a right way and a wrong way to do it. Those who do it the right way have more than enough proof of their success with regards to their income, but more importantly, those who strive to achieve the same success follow the example they've had with a great and honest sponsor. In order to be an effective sponsor, you need to be well educated on how the matrix works, the ins and outs as well as the compensation plan. You need to have a firm understanding of the fast start bonus as well as the matrix bonuses, the five and six dollars per person per month matrix payout. Your prospective affiliates will be relying on you to educate them on how to succeed. This is vital because it's your job to help others understand so they can do the same to their affiliates. It's a never-ending circle, but a circle, if done right, pays for a long time. The KISS principle is a most important concept when building your team. If you're not familiar with the KISS principle, it stands for keep it simple, stupid. You don't want to overload your prospective affiliates with so much information that they feel overwhelmed or immediately lose interest. You need to keep it simple, like if you sponsor 20 gold people in your first 60 days, you'll earn $6 per person per month. It's simple and to the point. When explaining the Quick Start program, you need to be simple. You need to always assume that they have zero experience in network marketing. You need to present it in a way where both the inexperienced and the veteran network marketer will understand it the first time. That should be your goal. It's vital to keep it simple, stupid. Sponsoring is much more personal than recruiting because it requires time, effort, and the desire to see those you sponsor succeed. Recruiting is all about the numbers and not about the person. If your whole focus is just building the number rather than the person, your turnover rate will be massive because those you recruit have no real direction on how to sponsor or succeed over a long period of time. They will get discouraged and they will feel like they were scammed out of a hundred bucks and will never look at a network marketing opportunity again. So many people have fallen into this trap and eventually give up. Now keep in mind that people will quit. High turnover is common in this business but it doesn't need to be guaranteed. When you are making a list of people you want to sponsor, make sure that you are focusing on people who you, now can, who you know can replicate your efforts. If you just focus on every Dick and Jane, you're gonna become a recruiter rather than a sponsor. Mark Zuckerberg, the founder of Facebook, was asked recently what qualities he looks for when he hires someone. His response was simple. I hire people that I can see myself working for. 
That's a powerful lesson in sponsoring. It is key to those you sponsor to replicate your efforts and go beyond. Successful teams don't rely on one person. They are unified in their goals and rely on each other to achieve them. So my challenge to you is to make a list of 10 to 20 people that you want to approach. But be specific with that list and focus on those that you know will carry your torch and inspire, inspire others to do the same. Once you have your list put together, reach out to your team leader or upline and get a call put together where your prospect can learn the details of the program, but also see the type of support that they will receive. This is a marathon business. It's not a hundred yard dash. Pace yourself, don't get burnt out, and the results will be life changing. Thanks for watching.